Welcome back to Google Guru. This video is brought to you by NeoNova. Hi everyone, I'm Bob Butchko with NeoNova Network Services. Today we're going to talk about how you can move items out of your Shared With Me folder into your My Drive folder within Google Drive. So if somebody shares something with you, one of the drawbacks is you cannot organize things in Shared With Me. And then the second thing is that only My Drive can be synced up with your local computer when you download Drive for PC or Mac. So there are a couple of benefits to moving things from Shared With Me up into your My Drive folder. Now to get to your Shared With Me folder, just log into your Gmail, click Drive at the top of the page, and then click Shared With Me. The very easiest way to get things from Shared With Me up to My Drive is check the box next to it and click Add to My Drive. What you're going to notice is it will stay in Shared With Me, but it will also be available in My Drive. That's because one of the most powerful features of Google Drive is you can have files in multiple folders at the exact same time. And you can see that same file is available now inside of my My Drive folder, and it shows that it's also still in the Shared With Me folder. Now, a second way you can move things over, and this is nice if you would like to add it to a subfolder, is simply by clicking and dragging from the Shared With Me folder up to one of your folders within My Drive. And you'll notice that now it is in the FTP folder. So that's a really nice way to move things as well. The tricky part occurs whenever people share folders with you. Now if you want to add the entire folder, the process is exactly the same. You can either check and then add to my drive or simply drag the entire folder over. The trick is, what if you only need certain items within that folder? And I apologize, looks like we have a refresh issue here. Just ignore that. <laughs> but what if I only need a couple of items out of this marketing images folder? Well, I tried dragging things over. I'm going to get an error message. That's because whenever you move things from within a shared folder into something within my drive, you're actually moving it out of that shared folder, which means that it will lose any share permissions that it inherited from that top level folder. You're going to be breaking share permissions. So you don't want to do that. And you'll notice also if you check the box next to it, there's no add to my drive button. There is, however, a very easy trick. So if you do want to move something over into my drive from within a shared folder, notice when you click and drag, the message says move. That means it's going to remove the current folder while it adds the new folder that you're dragging it to. And that's what breaks the permissions. If you hold down the control button on your keyboard or option if you're on a Mac, notice what happens to that message. It changes to add. That means it will not remove the current folder. It will only add it to the new folder. And you can actually see where not only is it still in that marketing images folder, but it is now also available in the FTP folder. So I can still access it from within my drive, but it's still within the marketing images folder. It has not broken the share permission. So again, the trick is anytime you're dragging something from within a shared folder up to my drive, hold down your control button or your option button if you're on a Mac and change that message to add, you will not break shared permissions. All right, everybody, I hope this was very useful. Enjoy your Google Apps and have a great day.